Assalamu alaikum. Today we are going to examine the case of foot and ankle. Basically, foot and ankle examination as a short case has been very tricky because we have to choose one line. Whenever you go and you encounter a case of foot and ankle, it could be a congenital telomeres equine virus. It can be cavo virus due to different causes. Most likely, it is due to short foot medical disease or you could have a case of foot drop and uh, as I have mentioned in my book, I have mentioned three cases of foot and ankle foot drop, CTV, cable virus foot so this is a case of CTV that we are going to examine and I will tell you where you will turn your scheme to the relevant thing and the other fourth uh, uh, pathology that I have missed is poliomyelitis so, in foot and ankle examination, reflexes are very important. Reflexes basically guide you where you are going. If the reflexes are silent, you must think of Charcot Medical Disease. If the reflexes are normal, you must think of CT. If the reflexes are exaggerated, you must think of cerebral palsy, CT. And likewise, in polymyelitis, reflexes could be normal as well as, uh, as in CTV. So, now we will examine this case of CTV. This is an adult case of CTV. But you can have a case of CTV of uh, the age 4 or 5 years. But the examiners prefer to have CTV more than 6 7 years. Because the patient of 3 4 years, it's not easy to uh, handle him, he mostly cries. So, in CTV or uh, as this case is, we will tell you the scheme. The scheme is same for foot and ankle. In inspection, you will start inspection from front, side, back. Then, you will ask to walk, gait, sit and squat and stand on tips and heels. These are the steps that I have mentioned in my course. After that, you will uh, ask him to sit down. When he is sitting, now starts the palpation. But before palpation, there is another step of inspection that must be seen. These are callosities that are not visible on standing, walking. These are the callosities on the lateral border or between the interdigital space. So, callosities must be seen on inspection when he, uh, the patient is sitting. Now, the patient is sitting and uh, you have to start the palpation. In palpation, you will go the same temperature, tenderness, in tenderness, superficial, just like in all my previous videos, but in deep tenderness, you will uh, name the bony landmarks. Then comes the pulsation. Pulsation is very important in CTV because there are cases when dorsalis fetus is absent or weak. And then comes the measurements. The most important part of CTV is Pirelli score and measurement of the equines. But in foot and ankle scheme, I prefer that after temperature and tenderness and pulsation, you go through reflexes. They will guide you whether it's a cerebral palsy or it's a case of short foot medical disease. So that after doing the reflexes, you apply the Pirelli score. So after applying the Pirelli score, uh, you will go for the movements, dorsiflexion, plantar flexion, inversion, inversion. You have to change the range of motion and in the case of polyomyelitis, you have to do the muscle charting all over uh, the foot and the lower limb. And uh, in the end, among the special tests, I would say, I have mentioned in my book, if the patient is of non-walking age, if the patient was not able to walk, then you have to check for associated condition. Examiners love when the candidate do the associations. So you have to check for TDH. You can do the telescopic test or the torticollis, it will be visible. And in the end, I would say that sometimes you have to perform, if you have time, then you must perform the steering profile view femoral angle, the uh, uh, other components of uh, steady profile as well. So we will start the examination. Start.
assalamu alaikum today we are going to examine this case of food and agriculture deformity so as i have told in my videos and it is mentioned in my books it's very important to look for appliances if the patient is using and it is very important to look at the footwear because examiners like when you do it so i'll start with them assalamu alaikum mera naam dr abdul khan hai mera taluq shobha haddi ka zor se hai main aapko mayna karna chahta hu ijazat hai अच्छा क्या मसला है कब से पैदाइशी ऐसा ठीक है और अब आपको क्या होता है अब चलने में ठीक है ठीक है आप इधर खड़े हो जाए सामने सामने खड़े हो जाए बिल्कुल मुंह मुंह पे खड़े हो जाए ऐसे बिल्कुल ठीक है तो बिल्कुल आसानी से आई एम वाइट स्टैंडिंग कंफर्टेबली Head and neck in center. Pelvis is symmetrical. Uh, bilateral thigh muscle is comparable. Patella or both both the patella are bilaterally comparable. Bilateral shin muscles are comparable. There is uh, uh, there is overriding of the lesser toes with forefoot in adduction bilaterally. Uh, Cabus bilaterally and the heels are off the ground. Callosities are visible on the lateral border of the. लेफ्ट फुट अब थोड़ा मूव इधर कर दूं एस एस इधर सामने सामने देखिए सर सामने देखिए बस हिप इज इन फ्लेक्स हिप इज इन एक्सटेंशन ही इज इन एक्सटेंशन ही इज ऑफ द ग्राउंड देयर आर नो कैलोसिटीज ऑन द लैटरल बॉर्डर द लैटरल बॉर्डर इज आल्सो ऑफ द ग्राउंड अब सर सामने उधर देखिए सामने देखिए So, like uh, there are no abnormal tuft of hair scar mark uh, on the spine. There is no fullness of the popliteal fossa. The heels, they, uh, they, the heels are less, more on the left side compared to the right side. There is a scar mark on the right side that is extending on the posteromedial margin, extending up to the metatarsal, uh, first metatarsal on the right side. There is also a scar mark on the posteromedial aspect. That is extending up to the first metatarsal. आप बैठ के उठ सकते हैं, नीचे बैठ के उठ सकते हैं। उठ जाएं। The patient is able to sit and squat. अच्छा आप मुझे चल के दिखा दें, चल के दिखा दें। Patient walks by middle, unsupported, walking on his toes. The heel and lateral border is off the ground. आज इतनी तो बैठ जाएं। Heel and lateral border is Regarding the footwear, there is depression on the lateral border of both. Start. No callosity at the lateral border. Interdigital. No callosity at the present. Bilaterally at the lateral border, there is a callosity on the left side uh, lateral border of the foot. Either the top, either challenge. Yeah, my hand is wrong. As my command is right side, so I will focus on the right side. Either show this. Temperature is bilaterally comparable. No pain on superficial palpation on deep palpation. Lateral malleolus, medial malleolus, talon head, subtalon joints, cuboid, metatarsals. Pulses are bilaterally comparable. Regarding the reflexes. एक जैसा, एक जैसा, 
एग्रेशन सेंसेशन इज बायोलैटरली कंपेयरेबल अच्छा अब आपने इसको ऊपर को उठाना ऊपर को उठाना डॉर्सल फ्लेक्शन इज 0 डिग्री नीचे को करें नीचे को सेट करें प्लांटर फ्लेक्शन ऊपर को करें नीचे को करें ठीक है ऊपर को जोड़ देना नीचे को जोड़ देना अंदर को करना पाओ शाबाश बाहर को करना शाबाश ऊपर को जोड़ देना नीचे को जोड़ देना अंदर को बाहर को पावर बाय लैटरली टॉर्सल फ्लेक्शन प्लांटर फ्लेक्शन फिलोनिए और बाय लैटरली कंपेयरेबल चलें अब लेट से करेंगे चेकिंग द सिल्वर स्क्वायर टेस्ट सिल्वर स्क्वायर टेस्ट इज नेगेटिव So this was a case of CDV, and most, most sorry, more specifically, this was the case of relapsed CDV. I have tried to do the necessary things in short case and avoid all the unnecessary things. Among the examination, if in moments you have to measure dorsal flexion, plantar flexion, but in case of long, long case. And as I have seen, and my different at the top of my differential it was a CTEV, so I have avoided to do the unnecessary things. So the examiner will ask you differential types of CTEV and how will you proceed. And there are uh, examiner like to uh, know about the patho pathology of CTEV. This is a new trend in examiners that I have observed. They like to know the pathology. So you have to study the accessory muscle, the artery issues in CD. So you have to learn a bit more than what is given in Miller Campbell. So you have to learn a bit more about CD. So at the end, they will uh, like to ask about uh, the treatment. You must know what is lambrin OD, you must know what is Bryce uh, Arthro disease. So basically you must know the extra-articular and intra-articular procedures as well because as uh, his age is 15 